guys and welcome back to my channel i am amaka of skybell beauty if you're new here you're welcome please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you're notified once i have a new video up today is another transformative video and i'm going to be transforming this gorgeous bell into a bridal bombshell i cleansed her face with my l'oreal micellar water and now i am prepping her skin using the cetaphil moisturizer skin prep is very key guys so that's what we're doing for the glow up i am using the nuban beauty liquid um, glow in the shade aurora to highlight the high points of her face To color correct, I'm using the Ellie Girl Orange Corrector. She doesn't have any blemishes, but she has bit marks, and I wanted to cover that up. For foundation, I'm using the ColourPop No Filter Foundation in the shade Dark 174, and I applied it using a foundation brush and now to blend i'm using my nuban beauty sponge which i really love now she looks a bit washed out but we're going to bring back back the warmth and definition with contour to highlight i'm using the LA Girl pro conceal in the shade cool tan and i am applying that on the highlight areas with a flat brush I'm blending out that highlight with my sponge make sure your sponge is damp to get a good result now to contour her face I'm using my black opal stick foundation in the shade carob and I'm applying it with a flat brush I'm going over the places we highlighted and then I'll move over to blend out the contour. To set her highlight, I'm using the Beauty by AD powder in the shade Amber. I think this powder is really amazing. It's finely milled and the color is just perfect. I'm doing a little bit of reverse contour with that powder and setting her nose. Now to set the contour, I'm using the Lady V Pro palette, the powder palette, and I'm taking the shade Maroon and I'm using that as a contour powder. It's a really warm, gorgeous brown. Now to set the rest of her face, I'm taking the shade Chocolate from the same palette with a powder brush. I'm just wiping off that setting powder and blending the rest of her face. To set her face, I'm using the Nuban Beauty Fix It, Seal It, sorry, setting spray. I'm melting down those powders and I use my brow gazing beauty line by Diddy pencil to fill in her brows. She has really thin brows. To give her a bit more fullness, I'm using my Hega and Esther brow pomade just to make the brows fuller and I am cleaning up the brows with LA Girl Pro Concealer in Cool Tan and Fawn. Now I'm blending that with a synthetic brush and dragging the rest of the product to her lid. To 
To set her brows, I will take my Blood Cosmetics Brow Gel in the shade Light Coffee just to set the brows in place and lighten the color. This stuff is super amazing, guys. And I'm using the same Beauty by AD setting powder to apply all over her lid to set it in place and then I would put some under her eyes to catch the fallouts. For her eyeshadow, I'm using the Morphe 3502 palette and I'm taking the shade Orb to set her in her transition area. Next up, I'm going in with this warm corally brown using my Morphe M441 brush and I'm putting that on the outer V and taking it slightly into the crease. So I'm taking this really dark brown and I'm putting that strictly on the outer V for more depth. To cut her crease, I'm using my P. Louise base in room 5 and my Colourpop E6 angle brush. I'm just setting that base, making sure it's nice and set on both eyes. Now I am taking this corally warm shimmer shade and I'm putting that on her lid. And I'm switching over to Perception Palette, taking the shade Strut and Slay for her inner corner highlights. The tight line, I'm using the Mabrook Black Pencil. This stuff is super black and super soft. Amazing for tight lining. I'm also using the same product on her waterline and the Zaron Mascara. This is the final look guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, she looked so flawless, ready for the altar. And stay tuned to see the transformative looks at the end, we transformed her into a traditional bride and we transformed and wore her some nice auto gele. so if you want to see that, please watch till the end. Bye guys, I'll see you in my next video. Thank you.